at the end of the day, we're all special. Every person, you need, you have spe specific needs, which makes us all exceptional. Basically, as an educator, I strongly believe in um, educating all children together um, and not segregating them, and hence, that's what inclusive education is all about. I guess diversity, when you think about it in education, it's really broad, but what we're um, kind of like focusing or, no pun intended, zooming in, in our field is that um, all children, regardless of background, regardless of um, ability or skill and regardless of diagnosis or exceptionality should be educated together with all other children. So basically no segregation. However, provided with appropriate teaching strategies and activities given by the gen ed teacher. I think providing equal opportunities would entail giving students, e each student, what is due them. It's not really giving everyone the same because it's not really providing them with opportunities that they need. Just by simply knowing where the student is at in terms of their learning, knowing the background of every student, and I think that is the best opportunity that we can provide them, that we just have a listening ear and an open office to them whenever they need help. We're, as a university, I think we're slowly getting there. Um, the SWDB coordinators and the Office of Student Affairs have been already pushing and working towards it. I mean, it's a big, it's a huge step also for the university to include in the um, USTED applications um, a part wherein they ask a student if they have a disability or if they would need like um, some form of support either before they take the USTED or during their stay in the university. And I think that already is kind of like a big leap. For ev I guess for everyone, it's really more of, we need your help. I guess every human being in this world, like even if you're just here to talk about special ed or you're here to talk about how uh, people with exceptionalities are just supporting them, I think that's huge. Um, as I always say, people with disabilities, with exceptionalities, they're the ones who are gonna solve the problems of this country because they're the only ones who can really think out of the box. They don't think like us because I just see the way they think and it's like so like literally out of this world but that's what we need. We need out of this world thinking and they're the ones who have that.